Hi guys, I'm here with one really really quick video because after two and some months, two years and a few months, I finally managed to fix my green screen problem. For those of you who know me, they know that I haven't been streaming and making videos for quite some time and mostly since the launch of the expansion even though that was my priority but I had this huge issue with the computer anyway so I finally managed to fix it I've been getting a green screen and I don't mean the green screen of that where you actually um, get the text like the blue screen text but just on the green background no 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 I mean your computer crashes, you see a completely green screen, no text, nothing, and then it restarts. So I've been having this problem whenever I try to use my graphic card, like more than 20% of its power. Lately I've been getting it when I try to stream and even when it's just sitting on background, like not background but just, just sitting the computer with nothing working. Like I started and I leave it to go and make a coffee or something and it crashes and it restarts itself and it was completely unplayable so what I did I tested I sent a motherboard oh I did many things uh, for those of you who are interested in what else might be the problem please let me know in the comment section below and if enough people are interested I will make a video with complete list of what I did and what could be the problem so if you have this problem you can actually try and all of those things that I've already tested and did not work for me since I had tested most of the stuff I was sure the problem is something like really, really stupid something that is so simple and in the same time you could never think about it and I was right so the last thing I did was I bought a new power supply bigger because I thought well maybe it doesn't have enough power to run and I installed it and it was working completely fine but <laughs> the way I installed it was the box was wide open and I just plugged the stuff where they're supposed to go it was working fine I could play all of the games like the heavier or not optimized I'm not sure I have is Outriders and I've been playing it on Ultra fine anyway so when I actually put the computer back together, you know, tidying up the cables, removing the older power supply because it was still tied up inside the, all the cables and stuff inside the, the box, the, the case, it crashed again. I did two things when, back then. I installed the power supply, like put everything together and I put back my hard drives. So I was like, okay one of them is the problem but let's start with the simple one I opened the back plate of the case you know the back thingy that you close and I haven't got a problem ever since so I would assume that some of the cables because there are so many up there and the space is so tight it's being not well pressed down or something and it's giving me a power shortage so when it attempts to use more power it crashes so I know I've heard that take out your cables put it back together like everything sure you probably did that like unplugged and plugged back in that's not how it works I tried it so try to reorganize the case or maybe open it so the cables will be not pushed down because when I close it I hardly close it and it stays like this bumpy because the cables are way too, too many and way too thick and the new power supply that I got which is actually really good it's a thermal take 850 gold edition I will post a link for exact one that I got the link will be 
affiliate so if you buy it with this link it will really help me out I'll get small, small commission. Um, I'll post an affiliate link because I'm happy with this. It's completely module, it's gold, no I'm not sponsored by it. Um, anyway, so that was the simple stupid problem I had for so many years that no other person who knows what the hell is going on could think of and fix. Finally did it. I haven't got the problem for a few days I've been playing on the... Pfft. I've been tormenting this card really good. Because first I thought this was the video card. It's been fine. So I'm going to keep it like this, at least for now, before I think of where to move the, the damn cables or buy a bigger box. I don't know, we'll see. But that's how I fixed my incredibly annoying problem because, let's be honest, to have a good graphics card and not being able to play even at games that my phone could run, it was really annoying. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching, I hope this video was helpful, if it was, make sure you let me know by liking, comment and subscribe, and see you next time, bye bye!